Here, Timmy Sheep. Here, Timmy Sheep. Here. Welcome back. Episode 15. And the fifth time that we're going to be talking about what do the scriptures mainly teach? The scriptures, which are found in the Old and New Testaments, they are the only rule to direct us how we may glorify and enjoy God. Our verse for today is found in the Old Testament. A lot of times we find our scriptures in the New Testament, but this time we're going to get one from the Old Testament. And it's from the book of Job, which is actually the oldest book of the Bible. Job chapter 38 and verse 4 says, Where were you when I laid the foundation of the earth? Now the reason that this verse is selected is because Job was asking God all kinds of questions. And God was basically just telling Job, look, these are my decisions. This is how I've decided things are going to go. And you really don't have a say here. So what happens when you're drawing a picture? You get to choose which colors you want to choose, right? And who's going to be in the picture? Yep. Mm -hmm. And when Cammy goes out to play, he gets to choose which um, games he's going to play with the other guys, right? Yeah. And when I'm playing um, my guitar, I get to choose which songs I want to sing. It's not really just about what do I want to do willy-nilly. It's when God was making his choices, he's the first and he's the best of beings. He makes the best choices. He was there before anyone else laid the foundation of the earth. He makes the best choices and he wants us to glorify and enjoy him because he's the best. Which means when we glorify and enjoy him who is the best, we are glorifying and enjoying the best thing. That's the most loving thing that God could ever require of us is to love and, and honor and exalt and glorify the best thing. If we glorified things that were not so great, well, how would that be any good for us? It would make us look silly, right? And we would make gods of other things. But God says he is the first. He is the best of beings. And he wants us to glorify and enjoy him because he's the best. Thanks for joining us today. Next time we're going to be reading from our book again. I think we're going to be starting with chapter four. Oh my goodness. And we're going to be starting a new catechism question. Hooray! All right. See you next time.